Hey everybody, and welcome back to LGT Play some more Divinity Original Sins 2. Uh, last time, we basically leveled up and uh, got some revenge on some frogs that were, you know, took us down in, in the past. And then we found this little boy and he wanted us to find him. We found him, and he wants us to meet his best friend. Now, I watched it, it the movie It recently, so I'm not sure if I trust this kid. That's all I'm going to say here. That is a giant... Statue, let's quick save real quick, just to be on the safe side. Um, look, look around first. Go back. Hadn't you brought... <gasps> Brockus Rex! Who's this? That's the, the, the thing. That's the what the guy was talking about. Decaying touch scroll. You have 7 to 8 physical damage to target. Sets decay to the target will take piercing damage from healing spells and potions. Ew. So, Brockus Rex, if you guys don't remember, we have... A book, unless I sold it, that told us about Brachus Rex and how he there was like a. Is this it? Uh, I believe Barbara. I might have sold the book, but basically there's a treasure of Brachus Rex somewhere. I just don't know where. I think I sold the book. I don't think I was paying attention to which book I was selling or not selling. Oh jeez. You know, this stuff happens. You forget what's useful. You forget what's not useful. Let's talk to the kid right here. Like him a lot. Wither? Lord Wither Moose. Brachus Rex. I don't know, man. Please, small child. Leave me to my room in this <laughs> The kid annoys him, doesn't it? But he's really nice. And tall. Maybe he can even help you with that thing. Alright, well the fact that he's undead, I'm gonna help him because what? I'm undead. A grown friend. You brought an adult here. Good. Good gods. Can it be? Alright, team. All right, team. Uh, split up for now, just to be on the safe side. Los, you stay back here. You, right here. You, and right there. Move the chair around a bit. <gasps> we gotta go. This one's crazy. Quick load. Quick load. <laughs> I didn't mean to hurt the kid. I did not mean to hurt the kid. I did not think that would hurt the kid. Oh, I'm such a dummy. I have to be more careful with that type of stuff, I guess. Because I assume just moving things around wouldn't hurt people, but maybe I'm just I'm just wrong. And it hurts them a ton. But good thing I quick saved. I'm learning my lessons though. Wither, yeah. Please. Yeah. Why? Just do a quick look around, see if anything's different. No. You brought... I did not mean to attack that. Alright, we'll talk to you. We still- we'll still separate though. Has to be on the safe side. Over here. Red Prince over here. Actually, I want Red Prince to be over here. I want him to have a straight line at this. I- I thought the- you, dead walker. Tell me I thought I would be able to move around and just open the box if there's something in there. The town of Brackus Rex. Uh, what are you talking about? Terribly sorry, my friend. My manners may be very, very out of date by now. I've been down here so long, so dreadfully long, and yours is the first living face I've seen. <laughs> living face. Uh, you seem rather close with Modi. He doesn't count as living face. A child may technically be alive, but so is a potato. Dude, it's rude. Me. No. Modi cannot help with what I ask. Alright, so what are you, why are you trapped down here? A wicked king, it was. Brachus Rex by name. The Order of the Source Hunters discovered a great horror upon this prison isle, and I was sent to stop it. Yet, okay. my failure was absolute. I am not fit to bear the insignia of the Source Hunters any longer. Okay. Please, good sir. You must free me. Prize this spear from my chest. Where it has been stuck fast for the last thousand years. Dude, how are you still alive? Seize the spear. End this degradation. I beg you. Alright, I'm doing this. Please. This because he's a dead man. Withermore soul jar. Okay. It's stuck fast. Please. This it's stuck fast. Alright, we need someone with strength. Can you do this? Yep. I got it. Good, sir. 
You've set my body free. Free to crumble to dust at last. But my spirit... Blast! I remain trapped in this mouldering skeleton yet. Hmm. What binds you? Spell most terrible. Okay. I have heard of such magic, but have never known anyone so foul as to employ it. Bracchus Rex, may maggots lace his entrails. After he interred me in this cell, he must have drawn my very soul away from me and stored it elsewhere in the fort. Thus, he has bound me entirely to the mundane realm. Okay, so that might be where the Bracchus Rex treasure is. It might be there. But I know this place well. I could lead you to its likely location. In turn, you would find a path straight out of this fort. My freedom for yours. What say you? Of course. Marvelous, my friend. Marvelous. You'll first have to get inside the fort itself. There's a secret switch on a statue of the seven. Oh, I've done that already. Surely you know it. Yeah, I know the it. The switch will open a hatch, and you'll be led into the prison's main floor. I suspect that within Bracchus's phylactery room, you will find the container which ensnares my soul. He has likely disguised it well, but search there for another hidden switch. So Bracchus's phylactery room. Okay. Bracchus would have made me a supplicant, a slave to these walls. With your help, I'll die. At last. With dignity. I was you know anything else? about this awful place before I came. My goal was to destroy the fiend who had been marshalling the world's most unwholesome weapons and magic into an army he intended to use against the realm. I never thought I would become one of his victims. And yet, here I am. Is there anything more you can tell us about the Silent Man? Fort Joy is a dangerous place, my friend. Dangerous indeed. Bracchus used this place to build an arsenal of terrible weaponry as yet unseen in our world. Here, he and his researchers crafted punishments and snares contrary to human dignity. Objects that could contain souls. Ones that could purge the very essence from sorcerers. My order would never have used such barbaric magic against our enemies. All right, so now we know what we have to do. Good, sir. Uh... You set my body free. Free to crumble to dust at last. But my spirit... Blast! I remain trapped in this mouldering skeleton yet. So, over time you be have become frail, but I seem to be getting stronger. Then you may be glad you have escaped the curse of Bracchus Rex. After he interred me in this cell, he must have drawn... But I know this place well. I could... Marvelous, my... The sweet oh, okay. Bracchus would have made me a supplicant. A slick yes. without your soul. Alright, we okay so okay so basically we know what we must do now. We're going back into that place. Uh it was a pull of something room. Some type of room, I don't remember the name. But we know how to get there. Uh we've done it a couple times. Also, why does she still have this? Why does she still have the quest marker? You go. Alright. I mean if I, I wish you would let me steal your stuff because I saved you, but I guess not. I will talk to you what though. Do you, need? you have anything I can use? Dude. Dude. Hold on. Ooh. Ooh. What sword do I have equipped right now? As a character. Ah, well. Spear of Bracchus Rex. Two handed. Don't really care. Uh, what, what weapon do I have currently? And, uh, for this guy. I have Magister's Sword. You know what? I may be interested. You, the Red Demon. The Exiled Pig. I'd heard they'd sent you here, but I'd hoped you'd have drowned yourself before crossing my path. Uh... <laughs> Alright, you know what? You don't take that tone with me. I step forward and slap him. Your strike makes the lizard recoil, but he soon regains his bearing. Slowly, he draws his weapon. If you want to fight me. When a slave strikes a master, the slave dies. You are a demon slave. You die! Alright, well, you know. Just so you know, this is all on you. Uh, sure, why not just do a regular attacks? The crossbow.
Why are you attacking Los? Seriously. She did nothing to you. She's crippled, so she can't do anything, but it's okay, we'll just encourage. We'll do... Soothing Cold? Magic Armor? I guess we don't really need Magic Armor. We'll just do a regular... Staff of Mages. He's about to die. Real easy. And he's blinded. Oh, my bad. Let's examine him, why not? Uh... Sure, wait, that doesn't really help, but well, let's go ahead. We're just gonna kill him. I mean... Can I steal his stuff that he had on his body? I can. Oh. Not everything, but most of the things. Holy crap. That's a lot of good stuff. Hold on. Auto sword. So we have a new sword for this guy here, for the Red Prince. Kali Stunner. Go ahead and give it to him, why not? Let's sell a bunch of this stuff. Is this level 4 item? Wow. Plus 1 strength, too. Okay, that's perfect. Let's sell this. Add to wares. Add to wares. Add to wares. Add to wares. Add more to wares. And we also had a bunch of skill books right now, so we got... Enrage. Motivation. Motivate an allied character with the power of rage. Target allied character is granted to land critical hits with basic attacks and weapon skills, but is muted. Clears taunted, terrified, charmed. Not really a fan of that. Provoke. Taunt the enemies around you. Provoke and tease them so that they want to attack you. I think this will be for, uh, definitely for the Red Prince. He's an asshole. So people want to attack him. So I want to give him provoke. Whirlwind. Perform a whirlwind attack hitting enemies. I think there's another, uh, another Red Prince ability. So basically, get people, do uh, taunt people. Well, for shields up, taunt, then maybe fortify someone else, then do a whirlwind followed by a shield bash that way it hits everyone. That's actually really cool. Holy crap. So excited I got that. As far as Enraged goes, I don't know how I feel about it. So I may just, uh, add it to the wares, because I don't really like it as a skill. Alright, so I'm pretty happy we still got that sword, though. So, wrong person. Oh, wrong eggs. It's over, uh, here. Okay, that's a hidden entrance, so that's just a stance for a secret. Okay. So, I think I'm gonna go straight to the soul jar, because I know how to get there. Easy peasy. Uh, actually go this way, so I don't have to go through the guards over here that want to kill us. Except the guards... ...aren't there anymore? No, they are. You're just far away from them. Alright, so let's go back to the secret entrance here. Also, we have full HP, good. I was worried that we were not gonna have full HP there. And then... How do we get... Doors open. I believe it's up here. Let's go up here. And this guy is still here. This lady is still here. We also have this area, which is a bunch of fire slugs. That might be something we might do too, because we're already here. But for now, let's go ahead and look for the soul jar. It's in a specific room, the pill of something. Here, let's look at my journal. Are the dog's kidding me? I, what, do you guys, did you guys not, oh my god. I'm being mostly ranged right now, so I'm just gonna move back. Two squares. That sword looks dope as hell. Uh, end my turn for now, I guess? Are you kidding me? It's only us? Oh my god. I didn't want to kill these dogs, so I'm just gonna put that out there. I thought they would be friendly because that last time we let them live, they were friendly. So let's go ahead and do... Let's go ahead and... How much... I have a lot of armor. This gives me an extra, what, 29? God damn, dude. Let's move. Let's stay here. Actually, before you do that, let's get Los into the battle first. There you go. That's what I wanted. So let's go ahead and do... Taunt. Oh, it's only... It's not as good as I thought it was. God damn. Alright, so we're gonna go ahead and do a sh Not a shield bash, at least not yet. Five meters away. So that's not gonna work. Is, uh... Hmm. I'm gonna go here. And do a flame breath, because they have to go out through that door. Unfortunately, it looks like I was not close enough to the door to apply that as well as I would have liked. 
Then we're gonna move back as far as we can. I could have gotten closer too. God damn it. I need to pay more attention with how well my action points are. Then we're gonna go ahead and fortify. My physical armor. She probably needs it the most, so we'll go ahead and fortify her. Let's go ahead and move him here and get ready for a battle stomp if they all come down here. This lady, come back here. Let's do an encourage because that's only one point. Let's do this. It's a regular. I may not try doing this, but although it does a lot of damage. Does it apply wetness? It doesn't say it applies wet, so I think it'll be fine. I don't think it'll take away that. Alright, that's fine. So now we can go ahead and just do regular attacks from this distance here. Low failed, but it's fine. That dog should probably be dead. Yep. Okay, so I will delay this lady's turn then. What? I had no idea that they had arrows. Alright, so now I guess I'm just gonna go over here. End my turn. Make them come out here if I can. I definitely did not think that was gonna happen. Alright, we're gonna go ahead and come up... ...down here so that they can't hit me. Then... That's tough. Uh... End my turn, I guess. Okay, that's basically more of what I want. So let's go ahead and do... We can make them all wet, probably. Yeah, they'll be all wet. Now let's look at where it was wet. So this is not wet, so I don't... I think... No, he's wet too. I'm not gonna risk it. So I'll just go with this hail strike. Right there. I think I hit two of them here. So I think I hit both of them. Try that. Did it freeze one? Magic armor. Of course. Oh god. Target is too far, so I just need to move a little bit further up, I guess. I don't want to use that many action points to use it. But I want to use all my action points as best I can. If that makes sense. Also the one of let's get let's step into the poison. Why not? I think that's a smart idea. And our turn. Alright, so Gojira's in a little bit of trouble there, because he's the one doing basically being hit all the entire time. Let's go ahead and try this. Okay, that was not bad not a bad idea. And we can also do this. Alright, I gotta move her too. So now I should be able to do shield bash and it should bounce around. That's not a shield bash. Shield bash and then it should bounce. Exactly what I wanted. Alright, so now I can come up here. And do this. No, keep moving. Uh, let's move. Here. Battle stomp. Try that. Blocked. Alright, I should be more careful about that type of stuff. Can I just try to knock this guy down now? I think I should be able to. Target is blocked. All right, then, uh... Move over here and just end your turn. But I should be able to attack this guy. Target is too far. Why is he too far? Oh, the smoke is blocking the view? Are you kidding me? Wow, that is something I never knew. Wow, that's actually kind of crazy. Can't, I can't attack anyone here? Where, where's the other dog? Oh, it's dead. So, what if I move here? I can't attack here. Okay, good. Not enough action points. Great. Alright, so I gotta move you here. What can I do with you? I can restore someone to HP, which I may as well just use it on this guy here. And what can I do with this? Oh, I didn't see that dog. My bad. Ow. Ow. Three attacks, okay.
Can I move there and then do a battle stomp for both of them? I should be able to. This battle stomp is physical armor. This will get rid of their physical armor. He wasn't knocked down though. Alright, whatever. Let's move here. This guy's knocked down. This guy's not locked down. So we're just gonna go and do a uh, charge. But he missed. The heck, dude. Uh, we can just probably just attack this guy. We can definitely kill this guy. And we'll just end our turn there. You can do anything you want. I'll just move you here though. Oh, he was knocked down. I thought he was knocked down. Never mind. Just a regular attack. Another regular attack. We're gonna go do a flurry because flurry is cool. Or not. Yeah, we could do flurry and then a regular attack. That's not enough. Well, that was a very <laughs> sad sounding noise. We'll use our bedroll. Heal up. Shiny red ball. You know, if he did not... if, if he, I can't believe he did not remember us, man. I'll take the eyeball. But, you know, we'll see how that is. Also, what is that? that, is that the, oh, that's a special thing. Where's the lever? That's where we're supposed to go to. Lever. Oh, where is it? Oh, there it is. We've done it. Quick save. All right. Trap gas pits. Try placing an object over the pit to stop the puddle or cloud from spreading. Um. Uh, so this is vase. So we're just gonna use the. I don't think I should use a teleport skill. So what I will do is I was my guy should be fine with it. Yeah. All right, that works. No, stop. My guy should be fine doing this by himself. Please don't walk into the poison glass by yourselves. All right, nothing in there. Lucky me that I have. A, honestly, I feel like Undead Lizard was like the best way to go. Like I feel like I have the most utility of all the characters I'm Looks playing like as. This place has been sealed up for a century or two. Because I can lock, I can pick locks. I can not die to poison, so that makes it easier for traps. To enter in the meantime. Soul jar. Two soul jars. Okay. That's a lot of soldiers. I'll examine it. Do I just have to take them all? I'm gonna go up here first. Because if anything, it feels like a trap. Ooh, stuff. God damn it. Please tell me, Red Prince, you can open it. You can. There's nothing in there. God damn it. Is it still too heavy for me, too? Yeah. Too heavy. I wonder if Beast can open it. You can. There's one more over here. So I'm gonna go ahead and try that one. Also, there's something else up here? Ladders. We're gonna, we're not, we're gonna do this at the end. I feel like maybe it's a trap. I'd rather do it that way. Beast, you're the strong man. That we deserve. Alright, nothing up there. Let's go up here. Double check there's nothing else. There is another one. Oh. There is another one. There's another thing over here. Yeah. So, okay, so we're gonna look, look at all these places real quick. Elemental arrowheads. Target a surface in melee radius. For one turn, elemental damage matching that surface is added to your ranged weapons attacks. Not a Huntsman, but it would be pretty good against with my character. Belt, Magical, Dwarven, Dagger. That's really good. Finesse 11. Okay. Take that all for me. Take that all for me. This is my stuff. Keeping watch over your bounty, I take it. I'm guessing that's a Brachus. Alright, so now... Go up here. But there's nothing up here. That's interesting. Why aren't people following me anymore? There you go, now you are. 
That's weird. You notice a deep fissure beneath a statue's right hand. I'll look at it more closely. The stone there is a curious color, as though it was added after the statue was carved. You know what? I actually do have issues in real life at like picking at things, so I'm gonna pick at it. A chunk of stone falls from the statue. There's something hidden inside. Tyrant stride, okay. Let's look at this. That is really good. Equip. Strength 11. I don't have the strength. Alright, so... Anyone can wear them. You know, you're my strength man here. Extra HP, you're, this is yours. Oh, no! Oh, no, no, no. PG. So, he's slow. I may just give it to this guy instead because... It's a slow thing. Uh, it's been cursed. Do I want to be slowed though? I don't know, man. At this point, I don't think so. Daggers. Get rid of my weaker dagger. Pocket knife, I guess, is the weaker one. Let's go ahead and get it and get it. Try it to wears. And who needs a sash? What's my sash at? Three? Um, I get the best items. That's how it works. You get the next best item, don't worry. Seniority rules. And uh, we're gonna keep these two daggers together, out of sort. These two daggers, I believe, are the better ones. And you know what? I'm gonna go get rid of this for now. I'd rather get the daggers, honestly. What does it say about the warmer dagger? Finesse. It doesn't say much about anything. It's cool. Uh, no boots, no nothing. I think we're good. <sighs> the fact that it slows you kind of makes me upset. I may get it because I have such great range. My dodging is actually really bad. Wait. Wow, how does, how does he have better dodging than me? He also has the same critical chance. I need better critical chance, guys. Alright, now... Of all the things I would open, which one would I open? I'd open this one over here. Wait, what does it say? Here lies Withermore the Yellow Belly. Here lies Withermore the Supplicant. Dude, what was his name? Here lies Withermore the Cold What was his name? I didn't pay attention to what his name was. Here lies it wasn't the Sage. the Sage. Here lies Withermore the Noxious. Alright, let's look at my journal. Hopefully that'll give us some information. Withermore. Ugh. Ugh. It's not noxious. It's not supplicant. Not yellow bellied. Let's do this one. I should have known. Oh! <laughs> I get it. So, based on what it is, it'll affect you. That's what I'm guessing. So now this is. What does it say? The sage. So this will be magic. Uh, Red Prince, where are you? Okay. Alright, I'm happy I switched over to these attacks. Level 4? What level are we? 4. Alright. So it's only 3 bad guys. 3 bad guys only? Alright, so now we got we got, we got got something. We can do this. I'm a little bit upset about the whole water thing, but it's cool. Not water, the ice thing. We can probably melt it with a fire attack. What can we do here? What can we do here? Don't want to poison them at all. Actually, not looking about thinking about that. Target is too far. Damn it. Mmm. Dagger toss, I guess. Too far. Let's move as little as we can as possible. Let's try that. Do another backstab of our own. Oh, I'm so happy you blocked it. Crippling bow? It's fine. So what can we do here? Fort who can we fortify? Let's fortify Los. Just so she doesn't get knocked down. She's actually really important to us, in my opinion. Let's go ahead and try maybe a fire breath on this. It's not going to reach him. He has a bunch of armor. 
Does this guy have any armor? He does not have armor, so just take him out for now. And then move over here out of the ice. Preferably. Luckily, that guy's really far away. Never mind. That range, though. And backstab crit. Okay. At least I got her to be protected, at least. Kind of. That's a backstab attack right there. We don't want that, really. This... Can't move crippled. Okay, so I basically have to attack this guy no matter what. Uh, unless I switch... Nah. I was thinking about switching to uh, the ranged attacks, but I, I, I thought it better. So now what can I do? Encourage. All these dudes are wet. I could make them wet and then do this attack. Hail strike, but that does, that's not enough actually. Uh... I'd rather attack them both at this time, honestly. So just do that. I don't have battle stomp with this guy, but he does have shield attack, which is actually what I want right now, because then I attack both of these guys. Yep. And what can I do here? How much does this do? One? Let's try to move... What's the range of this? It's pretty big. So we're gonna go ahead and be right here, and hopefully we'll be able to get all of them right here. Yes! Okay, well, I'm glad you're missing. Chicken strike. Oh no, <laughs> close. It's been, we've been turned on. Invisible. Alright, that's gonna be interesting. I don't think that person would have moved though. So let's go ahead and try to do this. Yes. Alright. Let's go ahead and do, they're both knocked down. And they won't be able to get up and again. Let's just do a quick dash. And kill that guy. He'll be dead at least for sure with this attack. I lied, with this attack. All right. Go here. Do whirlwind. Dude, this guy is honestly really good. Oh, I don't. I, I thought. I thought shields up was only one action point. I could do a flamethrower attack and get them both. It's a little bit dangerous, but I'll do it. The more damage I do, the better, I guess, is what I'm thinking about. So now I want to be. Here, let's do a blinding radiance. Make them easier. Make it more likely for them to miss us. They're both blinded. Nice. Can do a backstab on this guy. And do this. That guy's dead. I mean, why would I do that, right? I can just do normal attacks. Yeah, that's fine. Honestly though, I feel like one of my favorite characters in, these, in this game currently is the Red Prince. Dude, that blinding just missed. That blinding is so good right now. Shocking touch. And then just a regular, let's do a flurry. Let's do a throwing dagger just to finish him off. And there you go. Easy peasy and maybe new items. And maybe new items? And maybe new items. <laughs> Alright, I don't care that much about those items. Uh, what does this say? Here lies Withermore the yellow belly. I'll do yellow bellied. Hmm. Maybe I should have thought about that before I did. Pyromancer Guardian. Pyromancer. So we have an Ice Guardian. We're gonna go ahead and go to Concealment for now. Hmm. I have three action points. Who's the closest one I can get to? Doesn't really- it's, there's no real option here. Let's just go- what is- what does this guy have? Let it- low physical, low physical, low physical. There's another guy far away over here. Alright, I'm missing someone. Oh, someone up here. Eagle-Eyed Guardian. So that's gonna be a ranged person. So what I may just do... If I go up here, I'll be two on one. If I go up here, I'll be one on one for the most part, except for maybe this person here. So I'm gonna go over here. 
Maybe not the best decision, but we'll see. Yeah, ricochet. Ugh. Hmm, those. Alright, water. It's gonna be crazy. No! I didn't mean to click there! Oh no! Oh, I meant to do water attack. To get them all wet. I, I will do that. Oh, she's gonna freeze us. She's a chiromancer. I'm an idiot. I'm an idiot. I am actually an idiot. I am actually an idiot. I am like the world, world's biggest dummy. We need to get up there as fast as possible. Oh no, I should have quick saved earlier. Oh no. I actually like messed up real bad. Oh my god. Hail strike on the ground. Let's get closer. Let's get right behind the lady. Not attacking this turn though. Out of curiosity, we cannot reach that guy, okay. We'll just end our turn now so we have like, extra more damage next time. Alright, she needs to regenerate herself. If she can. Hopefully she can. Do it. I don't care. One action point, sure. And do this. I forgot about the block. God damn, I forgot about the block. Fortify. Fortify low is really bad. It's actually very needed. Please tell me you only have physical attacks. You have magic spells, don't you? No. Oh my god, no. I made a bad mistake. Try to separate them a little bit. <sighs> so what can I do here? I can do fire breath and only get one of them. Or I can just do a straight up attack. I can't do an attack, never mind. Fire breath would not be enough, I don't think so. So I'm just gonna go ahead and end my turn and get myself some more action points. Now I can do fire breath and get both of them probably there. Please let's not die. They both died. God damn it. I think I may have lost this battle. Because I'm an idiot. Not enough action points. I can I have five health potions on myself. Why am I such an idiot? Oh my god. No, don't do that. They're undead. There's something I can do. What is their physical armor like? Let's do this. Let's do shields up. What is this lady's fire stuff? She's resistant to fire based attacks. Alright, so now. What about it? Let's get into the water. I basically just need to survive as much as I can with this guy right here. Oh no. Oh my god. No. Do this. I have scrolls of resurrection. I can use them. I will try my best to do this. Not enough action points. Alright. 
Get out of vision, I guess, is the best I can do. I don't have comedian cloak anymore, too. And their turn there, maybe? It can't get to me from here, it looks like. Alright, so I can probably do something with this from, with, with, from where I'm at. I could, one thing I could do, which I might just end up... Uh, what's their HP like? 72, 97, 90. No. You know what? I think th this is an actual loss for us right now. Loss is the important one. I got shocked. What I should have done is I should have delayed my turn. Because going first is not going to be helpful. Because if I delay my turn, I can bring her to life, which will make her give her turn probably. Alright, well... Basically, I just want these guys to end me. Yeah. We'll try to set up for it next time better. Yeah. So, we'll stop here for now. I'm gonna try to set up better for the next battle. I mean, unfortunately we did die. But I thought we did pretty okay. We'll see. I don't know. I forgot where I last saved. Hopefully I saved in this room. Hopefully. Well, let's, let's find out. Alright, we did save. Oh, this is during the battle. I saved during the ice phase. Let's go, we'll go back to the ice phase. Which I think we, that means we just have to refight the... Uh, what do we have? The dead skeletons? I think that I'm okay with that for the most part. Uh, we'll try to redo this battle when we come back on the next episode. I, you know, it was basically just poor strategic thinkery, I guess. Anyways, hope you guys enjoyed this episode and we'll pick up right here. Hope you guys enjoyed. I'll see you guys next time. Deuces.